Hi boys and girls. Today, our first experiment for day one is lima bean seed dissection. So we're gonna look at what is on the inside of a seed. So everyone knows that's how a plant grows. All plants grow from seeds. So these are lima bean seeds. And there's all different types of seeds out there for different types of plants. So a lima bean seeds are soaking in the water. So I hope you have your glass filled with a little bit of water and you have your lima beans in there. So mine have been soaking for about 30 minutes. Ooh, some of them have opened up already. So your supplies today are a spoon to get your seeds out of your cup, your magnifying glass, toothpick in case you need to a little bit of help opening the seed, and your lima bean seeds. So I have some extra ones here, and this is what the seeds look like before they go into the water. So they're hard, they're smooth, and that's how we describe a lima bean seed before it goes in the water. So you have a lab sheet I wanna introduce to you, this lab sheet that you're gonna be working on, um, and there's three parts to it. So the first part is, um, what is inside a seed? So you're gonna give me a sentence to tell me what you think is inside a seed. And um, before we start the experiment, we should fill this out. Okay, so give a guess about what do you think is inside a seed. Then our next section is dry seed. It says look carefully at the lima bean, draw what it looks like in the square, and describe it in a sentence or two. So what does a dry lima bean seed look like? Okay, so those are the two parts of your lab sheet. And then you have a seed diagram that we're gonna label with the word bank, okay? And I have a little color picture here after we look at what's on the inside of the seed. So that is your activity, this is your experiment, and this is your lab sheet for today, okay? So those are your supplies. So um, we're gonna take out our lima beans. I take them out one by one with my spoon and try to empty the water out or and put it on your paper towel. These two have already opened. Sometimes they're not as open as this, and you have to use your toothpick to help you open the seeds. This one, I'm gonna leave him in a little bit longer. He looks like he needs some more time to soak. Um, so look at the seeds. Let's look at the outside of the seed. So the outside, this white part, and you compare it to the dry seed, is called the seed coat. And the seed coat protects the seed from insects or water when it's in the dirt, okay? It protects the seed, the inside of the seed so the plant can grow. And it gets wrinkly when it's in the water, our water, when it's soaked. So sometimes you can peel it off. This one's kind of, you can only peel a little bit off. The longer that you leave it in the water, the easier it is to peel off the seed coat. So here's the inside of our seed and this tannish part is the biggest part and that's the food for the seed. So it's called the food storage or a scientific term, cotyledon. Okay, so that's this big brown part and that's what the seed uses or the plant uses when it's growing, that's the food. Because it's in the dirt and it doesn't have any sunlight, right? Plants need sunlight. So it uses the moisture from the soil and this food source right here to grow. You can use your magnifying glass to look at it up close. So don't put your magnifying glass too close because you really don't get the magnification. Pull it kind of back a little bit farther and you can see, um, you can see the inside much clearer, okay? So this is the other seed. I don't really see, I'm looking for this part of my seed. I'm looking for the leaf and I'm looking for this embryo part, which is the root, which is gonna become the root and the stem, right? Those are the parts of the, of the plant, the roots, the stems, the leaf, the flower. So I'm gonna look at this one with my magnifying glass. Oh, I see it. Usually it's at the top part of your seed and in the middle here, I can see it right there. So maybe I can get a little bit, open it up a little bit and I can see I can see the leaf here, kind of in the middle of my seed at the top, and then I can see the embryo here. So that's gonna crack out 
and come up and start building your plant. So use your toothpicks if you need to open up your seed. I didn't need to for these seeds, but maybe for this one, I'm just gonna let it soak a little bit more. So this is what the inside of a seed looks like. It's super interesting to know. Um, the last part of your lab sheet wants you to draw what the inside of a seed looks like and write a sentence or two about what you see. What does the inside of a seed look like? And you can use some of your academic vocabulary from your um, diagram of a seed to answer that question, okay? So we have the leaf, the stem, I don't really do the stem, I usually put the stem and the root together as the embryo, food storage, and the seed coat, okay? This is four major parts. I hope you enjoyed the experiment. Um, it's cool to use your magnifying glass and to look at them and see them up close. So thanks for joining me for this experiment and don't forget to finish your lab sheet. Um, you can take a picture of it and send it to me if you want to use this as your work sample for the week. So thanks for joining me. Um, tomorrow's experiment is going to be growing a plant um, inside a Ziploc bag. I'll see you then. Bye.